Hey everyone, this is Tim from Your Six Studios. Today in this video, I'm going to show you multiple different ways that you can increase your storage on your PlayStation 4 so you can have more than two games. So let's go ahead and jump into the video right now. So that is right, if you have the original PlayStation 4 500 gigabyte hard drive, you can only pretty much have two games installed on your hard drive if you have Call of Duty Black Ops 4 and then Modern Warfare, that is all the games you can play. So what are some ways that you can increase the storage space on your PlayStation 4 hard drive? Well, the easiest thing to do, first of all, is to check your storage and delete anything you don't want. So I'm on home screen of the PlayStation 4. Let's go over to the settings section right here and then go down to storage. Now this may take a little time to calculate, so just be patient. Once it does, it will show you everything that's on your PlayStation 4 hard drive with all the games, saved data, and all your capture gallery clips. So I have a 1.5 terabyte hard drive in my PlayStation 4 and I have around 450 gigabytes of free storage space on my PlayStation 4. So let's select X on this and look at everything that's in my system storage. So the first thing is applications. Let's go through here. And you can see all your games like um, Minecraft, No Man's Sky. Delete all the games and applications you don't need anymore. Press options and you can delete multiple games and applications at the same time. So I do not need the infamous soundtrack anymore. PT, I have never played, but it's still on there. I can delete Play Memories, Sonic Mania. PlayStation View is no longer supported anymore, so I can delete that. So once you have all the games you want to delete selected, go over Delete and get them off your PlayStation 4 hard drive. And I just freed up around 100 gigabytes of free storage space now. Now let's go back and let's go to Capture Gallery. If you look, I have 61 gigabytes of storage taken up with the Capture Gallery just because I save a lot of clips. So you can go through your clips right here and select the game. I have 57 gigabytes worth of saved clips just in Call of Duty Modern Warfare alone. I can go through here and delete them by pressing Options once again. Get them over to a USB flash drive by pressing Options and going to Copy to USB Storage and get them off your PlayStation 4 because these half an hour to an hour long clips do take up a lot of storage space. Go ahead and delete these, get them off your PlayStation 4, and just keep all the clips you haven't used yet or you want to save. And then you have your save data, which is all your game saves and such. Typically, I just leave this on my PlayStation 4, but you could upload these to the cloud and just delete them off your PlayStation 4 if you're really that picky about space. Then you have your themes on the bottom here and I just have probably like three or four dozen different themes on my PlayStation and I like to keep those on there just in case I want to switch my theme to something else and then on the bottom you can look you can see your free space I have around 500 gigabytes of free space now on my PlayStation 4. Now let's jump over to method number two where you can go ahead and increase the system storage on your PlayStation 4. All right, so here is my PlayStation 4, and you can easily, easily expand the storage space on your PlayStation 4 by simply getting a hard drive and putting it in your PlayStation. You can take off the face cover here, and underneath here will be where you can plug in a new hard drive. So once you unscrew this, this entire thing will unslide out, and you can install a new hard drive. Now, the hard drive has to be a specific hard drive and I believe it's a 2.5 inch SATA hard drive so I went ahead and just bought a 1.5 terabyte hard drive and I believe this cost me about $60 so you can find these relatively cheap one terabyte will cost you $47 on Amazon and these are laptop hard drives you go ahead and just slide them in there and there is a little bit of an installation process that you'll have to go through you can watch one of my videos for that but it's relatively easy to install a new hard drive and cheaply increase the space on your PlayStation 4. Now the other method you can do is go ahead and get an external hard drive. And I have one right here. This one's connected to my computer and this is a five terabyte hard drive. So you do need to get a 3.0 USB external hard drive and you can plug it into the front of your PlayStation 4 just through the USB ports right here. Now, you can go up to eight terabytes of storage space 
with an external hard drive on your PlayStation 4. So this can easily, easily expand the storage space on your PlayStation 4. But if you're gonna go up to eight terabytes, you are probably looking at about $200 for an external hard drive. And that's why I like the option of just going ahead and getting a 2.5 inch internal hard drive here. For about 50 bucks, you can go ahead and get a one terabyte hard drive and that is very easy to install. You can have more than one or two games on your hard drive. So if this video did indeed help you out, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel down below for more PlayStation 4 tech help videos coming up next on your six studios.